Good morning guys, welcome to the shop. I thought I'd post a quick video here of uh, some dimensions. I'm doing the, I'm riveting the outside bottom, outboard bottom skins on the left wing of the RV-10. And uh, I kind of messed around last night. We put this thing in a couple of different positions to try and uh, make it ideal or optimal for uh, reaching in there to rivet. Um, this is where you uh, start riveting the skin here in this position. This is uh, not quite in the middle, but um, if you're doing one of these, you've got the plans and you know what I'm talking about. But uh, you got to reach up in underneath of here all the way up to the rear spar and start there. And then you work your way inboard and outboard both directions. And then you start to come down this way to the J stringer. And uh, then you start reaching in through the holes to do the rest of it. But so it's kind of a challenge and I'm doing this by myself. It'd be much easier with a with a helper. And I do it that way when when it's available, but it seems like most of the time I'm uh, working weekdays and the wife's at work. So I do 99% uh, of this is by myself. Anyway, um, I, I just kind of got lucky here. The, I, I can sit on this stool, which is two foot tall. And then I can reach up in there to the rear spar. The rear spar is about six foot off the floor. And the main spar, see if I can get out of the way here so you can see the whole thing. The, the, the main spar is four foot off the floor. I've got it sitting on the little uh, brackets or supports or whatever you want to call these things. I just, uh, just knocked those together when I started working on the wing. And then I set that on top of this little uh, end table that we had. Uh, but I had tried setting it up here on the bench. It was a little too high. Tried laying it flat. You can't reach around over the leading edge. Uh, so this seems to be working. Um, I think that's about it. If you got questions or want other dimensions, if anybody's uh, referencing this and, and you're about to do this, uh, uh, please ask. I'd be happy to answer. That's it. See you next time.